Hi, welcome to Brain Equation. Today's question is x to the power y is equal to y to the power x. So x and y are unknown. So let's begin. x to the power y is equal to y to the power x. So here let if y is equal to if we take y y is equal to k times x then k is a constant where k is constant plug in the value of y in the above equation our expression y here y our expression will become here we will plug in y x power kx is equal to kx power x so here we will write it in the bracket by taking square root on both sides by taking square root square square root on both sides square root x to the power kx square root is equal to square root k x power x so as we know that we know a very well known property we can write it as x to the power kx power 1 by 2 because we can write square root as a power 1 by 2 kx power x power 1 by 2 so it is very well known property of exponent that if we have a power m power n we can write a power m dot n is equal to a power n power m now we will use this property we will write here in the next step x power kx over 2 is equal to kx power x over 2 so here x power kx over 2 times we are going to multiply another power 2 by x on both sides kx power x by 2 multiply by 2 over x we have raised both sides to the power 2 over x now here 2 will cancel out with 2, x will go with x and 2 will go with 2 and x will cancel out with x. So here we are left with x power k is equal to k x. So by dividing both sides by x x we will divide both sides of this equation by x divide so here we will get x power k over x is equal to kx over x so here x will cancel out with x and here we will take x here we will get x k times x minus 1 is equal to k so here we will write x k minus 1 k minus 1 is equal to k 
now we will raise both sides of this equation by 1 over k minus 1 multiplying by power 1 over k minus 1 on both sides so we will write x k minus 1 multiply 1 over k minus 1 is equal to k k 1 over k minus 1 so here we will cancel out k minus 1 with k minus 1 we will left with x is equal to k 1 over k minus 1 so it is the value of x in term of k now what is y to find out y recall recall y is equal to k x here we will plug in the value of x y is equal to k times bracket k power 1 over k minus 1 here y is equal to k power 1 plus here power of k is 1 so 1 plus 1 over k minus 1 so y is equal to k here we can write k minus 1 we will take calcium k minus 1 plus 1 over k minus 1 so it will become k 1 will goes with 1 and k over k minus 1 so it is the value of y in term of k so we have both x and y in term of k now we want to find out the numerical value of x and y for numerical value of x and y if k is equal to 2 if we take k is equal to 1 then 1 minus 1 will give 1 over 0 which is undefined so we cannot take k is equal to 1 we will start from k is equal to 2 so from for k is equal to 2 we will find out the value of x we know that then x is equal to the value of x in term of k was k power 1 k minus 1 we will plug in the value of k which is 2 1 over 2 minus 1 so x is equal to 2 power 1 over 1 because 2 minus 1 is 1 so 2 x is equal to 2 it is the value of x for k is equal to 2 and now we will find out y y is equal to k times k power 1 k over k minus 1 so plug in the value of k which is 2 we will write 2 2 over 2 minus 1 so here 2 power 2 over 1 here 2 power 2 so y is equal to 4 2 power 2 is equal to 4 so y is 4 these are the two values of x and y for k is equal to 2 now we can check uh, our equation for these two values we can check our equation for these two values x is equal to 2 and y is equal to 4 check check our equation is x power y is equal to y power x so we will plug in x is equal to 2 and y 4 so 2 power 4 is equal to 4 power 2 2 power 4 is 16 and 4 power 2 is 16 so left hand side is equal to right hand side
right hand side similarly we can find values uh, value of x and y for k is equal to 3 these are the values for k is equal to 2 we can find out values for k is equal to 3 now let's find out the value of x and y for k is equal to 3 for k is equal to 3 x is equal to 3 power 1 over 3 minus 1 so x is equal to 3 power 1 over 3 minus 1 is 2 so it is equal to square root 3 because 1 over 2 is a is the power of square root so x is equal to square root 3 now y y is equal to y in term of k is k over k minus 1 so we will write 3 k is 3 so 3 power 3 over 3 minus 1 so here y is equal to 3 power 3 over 2 so y can be written as 3 power 1 over 2 bracket power 3 so y can be written as 3 power 1 over 2 can be written as square root 3 power 3 so x is equal for k is equal to 3 x is equal to square root 3 and and y is equal to square root 3 power 3 so these are the required values for k is equal to 3 so that's all about these questions all steps are very important don't forget these steps and thanks for watching don't forget to subscribe my channel for more solutions and videos till the next video bye